Governor Hope Uzadema of Imo State has challenged the newly sworn in commissioners to use their wealth of experience in the pursuit of job creation and revenue generation. The governor spoke at a ceremony held at the new executive chambers of Government House in Uwiri. Prince Uba reports. In May this year, Governor Uzadema dissolved his cabinet, retaining only eight commissioners. Seven months later, a fresh cabinet is in place. At the swearing in, 16 out of the 18 screened lined up to take their oath of office. The governor, while charging the new commissioners, said his government is duty bound to give Imo citizens the best and urge them to bring to bear their wealth of experience. There are more challenges ahead that call for our creative ingenuity. Indeed, the times call for the best of the best of our creative talents and value chain inputs. This is why I am glad that I have world-class technocrats in this team. I therefore challenge you, individually and collectively, to come up with the most creative and pragmatic ideas on how to increase our internally generated revenue without additional taxation on our people. Noting that his administration has zero tolerance for corruption, nepotism and infighting, he appealed to them to engage their energy in formulating policies that will strengthen the economy of the state. All your decisions and actions must be informed by dispassionate assessment of facts. In the unlikely event that you succumb to pressure and condone corruption or nepotism, you would have commenced you are inglorious exit from this administration and you will only have yourself to blame. We put in our time, we put in our treasure and we put in our talents because I know that when God created each and every one of us, he gave us our innate and different talents. That talent we are going to showcase it. We are going to show Igbo people that His Excellency didn't make any mistake by asking us to come and work with him. We are entering the, the, the second phase of the first term of four years. By January 15th, we must have clocked two years out of the first initial four-year tenure. So we need to do more acceleration so that Imo people will enjoy dividends of democracy under the shared prosperity vision anchored in the three arm. And believe you me, the government is already on the right course. Despite undaunting challenges, Governor Zadima believes that the cream of personalities in his new cabinet will add value to the government. Prince Oba, TVC News, Owerin.